my name is Amy Ecker. Welcome to my channel. So I am unboxing my June box way late. Mm-hmm. Way late. It has been a crazy June. I strapped on my seatbelt and just rode the craziness like Mr. Toad's wild ride. So I do apologize for being late with all of my unboxings. It has just been a wee bit crazy. A wee bit. Okay, so very excited about this box. We have the box. Clean Biotic, the pH Balance Yogurt Cleanser from Dr. Brandt. Dr. Brandt, I love about 90% of their products that I've used. So can't wait to see, does this one up the percentages of my love or does it bring it down? We're going to find Next, out. Next, we have the Living Proof Full Dry Volume Blast. It instant lasting volume and texture it is a styling and finishing spray so i have my favorites when it comes to hair products because i have really actually thin limp fine hair and so it takes a whole lot for me to have volume a whole lot like it's a process and then it still goes flat. So I'm interested in trying this Living Proof Full Dry Volume Blast to see if it helps me with my uh, with my quaff. If any of you guys have used this, I'd really like to know because I do have some standard products I just use all the time because they seem to be the best for this crazy fine flat hair. That's super okay. Thin. Next we have the No Problem Prime Essence. I, I read, a, I tried to read a little bit about it, but um, I guess it's for to get the skin, skin silky and smooth for better lasting makeup. It's um, the last step to your skincare, apply a moderate amount and gently pat over the skin until it's fully absorbed. So I'm not opposed to trying a new primer. In fact, my primer from Scandinavia I'm out of, so... Yeah, I'm going to be interested in seeing how okay, this next, does. Okay, next we have the DC Lemonade Lip Gloss. I did try this yesterday, and it is definitely a lip gloss. It, it feels a little thick. So just be prepared. I felt like I because it was thick, I had to use multiple coats, just like I did right now. It almost feels like it has a, a Vaseline type consistency. So I did read that you would have to use this, um, you know, of course with any lip glosses, etc. You're going to have to reapply throughout the day, but it does feel, does feel really good. I think for me, that's going to be more of a winter lip gloss, although I don't do lip glosses in general just because I hate reapplying. But when I do decide to use them, it is typically during winter. Okay, not then summer. we have the Tristique Good Vibes Mascara. So this just seems a little crazy to me. So it does have a curler in it along with the mascara. So I'm not ready to open up a new mascara and try it yet, but I will and then give a review because this having its own curler kind of intrigues me. Kind so of then me. we also got the Tardius Pro Glow, and the Tardius Pro Glow is absolutely beautiful. In fact, my last Tardius Pro Glow, which I keep right here in front of me, and it does look a little bit janky. It they are different. I was afraid they were going to be the same, and they are not. So I, again, I do keep my Tardius Pro Glow kind of right in my drawer in front of me so I do tend to grab this so I can't wait to actually use this one it actually is fantastic and beautiful these pinks I'm not a pink person but I do like those pinks I could I might be able to get away with that so very excited about having another Tardius Pro Glow palette because again I keep this one right in front okay. of me. Okay, next we have the Truffle Therapy Illuminating Skin Refresh Mist. It is a Radiant Dew. So this comes from Skin & Company Roma. It is a hydrating mist formulated to smooth, protect, illuminate the skin. It's inspired by an Italian legend of St. John's Water, a magical dew produced using flowers, herbs, 
during the summer solstice, which just happened, enhanced with antioxidant-rich soothing and detox detoxifying botanical extracts of black winter truffle, rosemary, ginger, peppermint. The peppermint you can smell in this. It has rose and the refreshing mist increase the radiance while rebalancing skin's pH level. It tightens pores and uh, you, you can use it as a setting makeup. So I sprayed this on and at first I felt like I was in a spa and I was hoping that that would stay but it just smelling my skin again it doesn't stay long as far as the peppermint smell so if you want to smell like a spa all day long this actually the scent goes away very quick the weird thing about what I just used as far as the spray goes the nozzle like sprays out wide instead of I don't know I feel like it's missing the total inside so it sprays like around but doesn't get the center. So not real excited about the uh, cap on that one. And I was really hoping that that scent would stay on the skin. It okay, doesn't. then we have the Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow AHA Refre Resurfacing Night Serum with Hydrating Honey and general, Gentle Flower Extracts. So I've been getting a lot of facial bits in my boxes that have honey in it and very excited about that since honey is so good for your body inside and out. This has a powerful multi-correctional night serum that resurfaces the skin for a smoother youthful look, glowing complexion. It has, it's formulated with 14% AHA, BHA flower acids to exfoliate and the proprietary honey blend to hydrate. You're going to put a generous amount, one to two pumps, on your clean skin at night, avoiding the eyes and lips, and you're going to use it two to three times a week, and you can build up and use it more. So when they say that it can be built up, it makes me wonder how Okay, how my last is. bit is kind of fun. It is, whoops, obviously it sounds like plastic. Okay, my last bit sounds like a bottle is this cute little hair dryer with bits to go with it oh my gosh I'm like dropping everything so this bit is for when you're trying to do kind of a fine hair look um, or a sleek hair look this little guy will help you then this little guy will help you build your volume etc as you uh, blow dryer hair. What I find extremely cute about this, not cute, it is cute. Come on now, this is cute. What I find intriguing about this is I can actually take this with me when I travel. Normally, I hate taking my Dyson with me. It's bulky, it's big, it works amazing, but like I don't want to waste space in my luggage because I'm one of those that if I can't carry it on, I don't need it for wherever I'm going. So I, I'm always hoping that um, the hotel has a hair dryer or if I'm staying at someone's house, can I borrow their hair dryer? This little guy will not take up much room. And so for me to get this, I'm absolutely thrilled because this will help me with traveling. I won't have to ask any of my buddies, can I borrow your hair dryer, please? So very, very excited about getting this little mini. It's so okay, freaking guys. cute. So that is the last of my unboxing of BoxyCharm for June. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, I can't wait to go back and look and see what everyone else got. I just hadn't had a chance in June. Again, June was crazy. All right, y'all. I hope you have a beautiful day. And yeah, make it a great one. Because no one else can do it for you but you. <laughs> All right, I'll see you in the next video.